For this video, I'm just going to show you how I just uh, run through um, a little bit of just post editing and just minor mixing on, on something like this. So here we go. So this is the rough audio, um, the rough mix that came from the editor himself. Hello, my name is Pastor Daniel Gonzalez, and I serve here at Cornerstone Church as a Spanish ministry pastor. I want to thank you for being part of our service today. If this is your first time visiting or you're tuning in online, welcome. We're so excited you joined us. As great as it is to watch our service online, it is so much better when we can meet face to face. Our pastors would love to meet you and tell you about the vision and heart of our ministry. Again, thank you and God bless you for joining us for this service. We look forward to seeing you in person very soon. Dios te bendiga. All right, as you can tell, the music's um, overpowering the, the voiceover on here. Um, there's a little bit of uh, clicks when he's speaking, and um, his level on the audio is a little bit inconsistent, and there's kind of a, a tinny thin type of sound, or um, or the, the quality of the, the recording from his, from his vocal. So what I do is, um, I go ahead and uh, you know name all my tracks. So this is the reference. I'm just gonna go ahead and make it inactive. You can hide it if if you would like, but I usually just keep it on the side just in case if I need to reference it for whatever reason. This is my dialogue track, um, track name DX, and on here um, I already did a little bit of uh, consolidating on here. It was um, a few a few clips on here. Um, I go ahead and I do manual edits on here and what that means is I go ahead and just you know add the fades um, typically if if the audio is a little bit inconsistent they're using a shotgun uh, Sennheiser me 66 I believe or the 600 so sometimes you'll see the audio file pretty low I just go in and you know I just boost it up and then I just make my fades and then I'll consolidate once again to just make it one single file like I did here so there's no need to do that but just showing you what I've done and then after that's pretty much clean I'll go ahead and set up um, I'll just set up you know EQ uh, I just use the stock EQ um, from Pro Tools the EQ3 I like using the Arvox for for a compressor works well and then I'm starting to use the channel strip from Avid um, getting more familiar with that because I usually just use you know just basic stuff from either waves or uh, or uh, Avid but I haven't been using this one so experimenting with like the channel strip and then of course a de-esser um, let's see so I'll just solo it Hello, my name is Pastor Daniel Gonzalez, and I serve here at Cornerstone Church as a Spanish ministry pastor. That's with processing, and then let me just bypass everything. And of course, I have, um, you know, the fader drop down at, at minus 4.1, and then... Hello, my name is Pastor Daniel Gonzalez, and I serve here at Cornerstone Church as a Spanish ministry pastor. I want to thank you for being part of our service today. That's what the EQ. If this is your first time visiting or you're tuning in online, well. So I'm getting the rid of, rid of uh, 600 hertz. Welcome. We're so excited you joined us. As great as. And a little bit of the, the mid highs, 4K. It is to watch our service online. It is so much. And then I just, just boost just a touch, like less than a dB on there. Um, for the highs, be a little Hello, just show giving it a little bit more presence. My name is Pastor Daniel Gonzalez, and I serve here at Cornerstone Church as a Spanish ministry. And I usually just uh, toggle in the high pass filter just to see how it sounds. Hey, Pastor, I want to thank you for being part of our service. This was recorded with the shotgun microphone, so you know just roll off any of the the AC noise in the studio. So after that, uh, our Vox. I typically aim between um, a compression um, like two and four on here on this attenuation and that gives me like pretty good results 
Hello, my name is Pastor Daniel Gonzalez, and I serve here at Cornerstone Church as a Spanish ministry pastor. I want to thank you for being part of our service today. If this is your first time visiting or you're tuning in online, welcome. If I'm doing a fairly heavy amount of uh, attenuation, I'll go ahead and uh, uh, bring the gain down, but it's going to be okay. And then the gate, um, I usually set the gate, you know, fairly low. So if it is any dead, uh, dead spaces in the audio, it's just going to, you know, cut it off. But um, I'm not too worried about this because we got the music in the background, the music bed. All right, so after that, I have the channel strip. Hello, my name is Pastor Daniel Gonzalez, and I serve... Hello, my name is Pastor Daniel Gonzalez, and I serve here at Cornerstone Church as a Spanish ministry pastor. So on here, I'm bringing a little bit of the mid-highs, and I'm dipping, um, let's see, about 500 again, because I'm just hearing this. I want to thank you for being part of our service today. It's like the resonance from uh, from the microphone. If this is your first time visiting. And then I got some compression going on, you know, two to one again, um, just to get leveling out a little bit more of the peaks. No no uh, makeup gain on there. Um, I haven't expanded gate. I haven't really touched this. Um, actually, this is part, part of it's a preset and I went ahead and touched the EQ and the compressor on here. So. The expanded gate, I believe this is just a stock setting. I may have messed with the threshold and hired up the, um, yeah. Yeah, threshold, and then of course this part's gonna be the threshold for the, the comp, so yeah. I haven't really messed with the expander gate, but if there's anything low, it's gonna expand the um, the the lower end of that, uh, the d dynamics on there. And then, of course, the de -esser, around 5K. Or you're tuning in online, welcome. We're so excited you joined us. Or you're tuning in online, welcome. We're so excited you joined us. As great as it is to watch our... So it's just catching a little bit of those um, those S's, those high high pitch frequencies. So that's the, the VO. And then after that, oh yeah, just, you know, your fade in, your fade out. Um, let's see. I use RX too. Um, I'll go ahead and uh, send that audio to RX within the uh, within Pro Tools. Uh, bring it up as a plugin, uh, like a round trip. And then if there's any like click noise, I'll go ahead and remove those. So just for example, get rid of that. But I'm gonna leave that. depending how he pronounces the words. Um, I'll clean it up, or if the word is needed, the beginning of a word, or like a T, um, I'll leave it in there. I don't want to sell it too dull. And then after that, I'll send it right back. That's pretty much the process for that. And then, of course, oh yeah. So I'll bring up uh, the, the waves, LM, WLM, and just make sure that I'm leveling the VO correctly. Hello, my name is Pastor Daniel Gonzalez, and I serve here at Cornerstone Church as a Spanish ministry pastor. I want to thank you for being part of our service today. If this is your first time visiting or you're tuning in online. So I'm going to be aiming for minus 24 with the music, so I'm not too worried um, right now what it's giving me. Uh, minus 27, that's, that's cool. Um, once I start bringing in the music, it's going to bring it up. And then, of course, I have... Um, some mastering processing too as well. So let's bring in the music. Hello, my name is Pastor Daniel Gonzalez and I serve here at Cornerstone Church as a Spanish ministry pastor. I wanna thank you for being part of our service today. If this is your first time visiting or you're tuning in online, welcome. We're so excited you joined us. As great as it is to watch. And of course, I've just uh, clip gain to negative 13 or minus 13 on this and then I did a little fade right here for the music too as well. For this service, we look forward to seeing you in person very soon. Dios te bendiga. Just to bring the music a little bit back in, um, it was fairly high or the, the music actually, the dynamics comes up uh, pretty loud so I just brought it down just minus 2 dB. Um, 
more. And then after I'm done with that, you know, fade in, fade out. And then I have my mastering. I guess it's like a pre-master, master chain uh, print into it. So I have um, this waves, the linear phase multiband. So let's. Hello, my name is Pastor Daniel Gonzalez, and I serve here at Cornerstone Church as a Spanish ministry pastor. I want to thank you for being part of our service Mostly processing today. the mid-highs. If this is your, your first mids. time visiting or you're tuning in online, welcome. We're so excited you joined us. As great as it is to watch our service online... It so you see, it's not even like compressing uh, any of those bands that much, but if it is a little bit over, um, it's going to catch it. So I just... I usually try to sound it as neutral and natural as possible because when you come across a, a television, um, if you emphasize anything um, too too low or too high, it's going to come come across either harsh or it's going to sound distorted. So just I aim usually for a neutral type of sound, um, and of course consistency on the on the meters once we get there. So us for this service we look forward to seeing you in person very soon Dios te bendiga. and then I introduced uh, the EQ3 just a little I guess detail um, or presence around 5k thank you and God bless you for joining us for this service we look forward to seeing you in person very soon and then I have a L2, threshold down uh, minus three dB on the threshold ceiling. I just leave it at, at one, so it's not going over zero. Hello, my name is Pastor Daniel Gonzalez, and I serve here at Cornerstone Church as a Spanish ministry pastor. I want to thank... So now we're getting, you know, 24 minus 25. And then, of course, my WLM. Take that off bypass. Usually I have true peak on here and we aim for um I usually aim it like at the true peak max just to be safe. I'll put it out like on eleven just in case, depending on where it's gonna go out to. Um you might have to check with the the, the um television stations and see what the requirements are. And then I have an analyzer from Waves as well. Just you know basic information on the on the analyzer just tells me where my frequencies are hello my name is pastor daniel gonzalez and i serve here at cornerstone church as a spanish ministry pastor and as you can see short term and long term um it's going to be hovering around minus 24 so that's what i aim for so everything uh combining from the dialogue your music and then into like this you know master chain um, I'm trying to aim for minus 24 overall and then here's the here's my version let's get rid of these let's see if I can drop that in there and then here's gonna be my mix hello my name is pastor Daniel Gonzalez and I serve here at Cornerstone Church as a Spanish ministry pastor I want to thank you for being part of our service today. If this is your first time visiting or you're tuning in online, welcome. We're so excited you joined us. As great as it is to watch our service online, it is so much better when we can meet face to face. Our pastors would love to meet you and tell you about the vision and heart of our ministry. Again, thank you and God bless you for joining us for this service. We look forward to seeing you in person very soon. Dios te bendiga. So that was my mix, and then here was the reference one. It's going to be coming in right now. Hello, my name is Pastor Daniel Gonzalez, and I serve here at Cornerstone Church as a Spanish ministry pastor. I want to thank you for being part of our service today. If this is your first time visiting or you're tuning in... The music's too loud in my, my opinion, so you can't even hear the VO. As great as it is to watch our... I have a little bit more presence. ...part of our service today. If this is your first time visiting... Yeah, I, I hear the resonant frequency all over his VO, and it's just... ...as it is to watch our service online. It just, it sounds bad. So yeah, this is just a quick video on on how I edit, um, you know, a spot for a television.